Uh, hi, my name is Apeksha Jain. I'm the founder and chief confiturier of the Gourmet Jar. We make a lot of innovative products like banana rum jam, mango alapino preserve, and a nutty pasta sauce, uh, etc. Uh, so I started this brand uh, from my home kitchen in 2012. Uh, what I was doing was very different. It was innovative. It was completely artisanal. I think booking uh, shipments on the Shiplight dashboard has made our life much easier. Uh, hi, my name is Apeksha Jain. I'm the founder and chief confiturier of the Gourmet Jar. At the Gourmet Jar, we make a range of premium condiments like preserves, honey, uh, pesto, mustard, pasta sauces, ketchup. And everything that we do is completely natural. It's preservative free, chemical free, uh, no additives in whatever we make. And we source a lot of our ingredients from farmers directly. Everything is handmade in our facility where we employ a lot of women. So all the products that you taste are handmade by women. And uh, yeah, so everything is natural, real, uh, preservative free. And we make a lot of innovative products like banana rum jam, mango alapino preserve, and a nutty pasta sauce, uh, etc. Uh, so I started this brand uh, from my home kitchen in 2012. And uh, it was uh, something that started out of a passion for cooking. I used to be a food blogger before that. And it was actually inspired by our stay in France where we uh, traveled to this place in Burgundy and had a fresh banana jam for breakfast. And my husband fell in love with that banana jam. And when I came back to India, I started recreating uh, that product for him. And uh, that's how it kind of started. I started making a lot more preserves in my home kitchen and experimenting with flavors. And when friends and family started asking for bottles, I decided to like, kind of put it out there for, uh, for people to buy. And luckily the response was really good. And uh, what I was doing was very different. It was innovative. It was completely artisanal. Back in 2012, when people didn't really know artisanal natural food that much, and the scene in India was very different. So it took off uh, really well. And uh, that's how it started and grew from there. With courier companies, it used to be a hassle in terms of you know manually telling them uh, to do the booking. And uh, after that, uh, sometimes they would turn up, sometimes they would not turn up. And uh, with the B2B supplies, when we used to send larger shipments to distributors across the country, we had to rely on our uh, trucking companies. And when, when that happens, you know, we don't know whether, uh, how long it's going to take. We have to call the transporter directly, you know, the owner uh, to get an update. And it was hard to track. So until the truck reached, say, for example, from Delhi, it was going to Bombay. And until it really reached Bombay, we would have no update as to uh, where the truck is or where, where our shipment is or when it will be delivered and our only point of uh, contact and the information that we could get was from the transport company or the owner directly and that used to be a big hassle and also uh, with the B2C supplies when we, used to, we would send smaller shipments to customers directly the logistics was not such an issue but just dealing with the uh, courier service was an issue you know getting and of course you had to pay up front and all of that. I think booking uh, shipments on the Shiplight dashboard has made our life much easier. We use a single panel for all our shipments, whether it's a B2B shipment or a B2C one, a small uh, one and a half kg, one kg shipment or a hundred kg shipment. So our operations team just has to log on to the Shiplight dashboard and uh, you know just enter the details of our shipments and uh, they assign the carrier according uh, to our you know the weight and destination. And uh, we are assured that we'll get the best uh, rate no matter what. Uh, so yeah, and that and of course that makes makes our life much easier. We don't have to really uh, rack our brains in terms of you know how to send the shipment through which carrier, which is the best and most optimal service. Uh, I think Shiplet has really been helpful in terms of the support, and I I mean logistics uh, always has challenges, and there's no nobody can guarantee that you know you'll uh, have no issues. But with Shiplet, I think what re what I really like is the customer service and support, and if we have issues with shipments. If they get blocked somewhere or they're stuck or whatever, we always get a quick resolution from them and at least we know that we have a person who can, whom we can reach out to and they can give us an update on what's happening. I think Shiplight can really help small businesses grow and it's really helped us a lot in terms of, you know, when from the time when we were processing say, uh, you know, 5 to 10 orders a day to processing like a few hundred orders a day, it's really helped us uh, and the process that we have to follow is the same. When you scale up, uh, Shiplight really helps, I mean the dashboard doesn't really add any additional pressure on the system and can process all your orders easily. So I think uh, that's a very big advantage and I think every any e-commerce brand can de definitely benefit from uh, from the services. Uh, rather than working with you know an individual delivery partner like a FedEx or a delivery or an Express Bees, I think uh, having an aggregator like Shiplight, it really works for advantage because we get a larger uh, you know coverage of pin codes we get the serviceability so if if a say a pin code is not serviceable by fedex and we can they always book the shipment through delivery or express b so any other carrier and uh, of course you know we have uh, we, we can get the best rates based on based on the pin code and the uh, and the package you know the size of the package so i think that's one advantage that 
instead of being stuck with one courier service and with their limitations in terms of import serviceability and their pricing, you have a more flexibility in a way when you're using Shipline. I think in the in the future when we uh, start doing international shipments, I think Shipline is going to be of uh, really you know uh, is going to be very helpful to us as well at that time because they do international uh, shipments as well. And yeah, looking forward to growing the Gurmeja uh, business together with Shipline.